Today on MTG Unpacked, it's snack pack time again, and we have a new patron up today. That is Jonathan Vogelsang. Thank you, sir, for becoming a patron. And he did not really have any preference for his packs or pack blesses, so I went ahead, picked a decent variety. So we got Core Set 2019, Dominaria Guilds of Ravnica, and a pack of Battle Bond. And doing the pack blessings today, we have Tezzeret and Ajani. So let's see how they do today. Hopefully get Jonathan some great pulls. But before we get in on the pack cracking, let us assemble the snack pack. So if you've seen this before, you know the drill. So we have five commons, and then we'll do five uncommons, a foil, and two rares or mythics. And there are also a couple of little surprises sprinkled around here, which we may come upon. We shall see. So good luck, Jonathan. Let's hope we can get you something spicy here. So we'll go four and one more uncommon. Now the, let's put those on top there, and then the foil, we'll grab one from right here, and a rare, and a mythic. Alrighty, so set that aside, let's see what we can pull you today, sir. We start off with Unnerve, Demystify, Double Cleave. And we got one of these from Ultimate Masters. We actually cracked open 10 packs on Christmas Day for the patrons and stuffed them in the box here. So hopefully people are very satisfied with that. Next up we have Vicious Offering and ding 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 ding! We have a wild card people! Jonathan, it's your lucky day because you get an extra rare. So let me sneak one out of the box over here and Pop that there, so hopefully you didn't see what that was. All right, let's continue. We have Merciless Eternal, so this is the uncommons now. Chandra's Defeat. What? Oh, wow, this... Okay, Jonathan, you have fantastic luck because these are quite rare. There's, like, two in the commons, two in the uncommons, and for you to get two of these... All right, so you get, holy moly, at this rate, we're gonna run out of rares here. So you get yet another rare. Okay, I guess this can happen. Uh, uncommons, we have Cherished Hatchling and Phantasmal Abomination. All right, and, ooh, look at that foil. You get a Glory Bringer. 4-4 four, four, for 5 mana with flying and haste. You may exert Glory Bringer as it attacks. When you do, it deals 4 damage to target non-dragon creature and opponent controls. And this is a special game day card. So you had to go in on that particular day and you'd get this promo. Very nice. Always fond of the Glory Bringer back in the day. And your next rare. You have a ton of rares today, sir. So you get Waste Knot. So this is an enchantment for 2. Whenever an opponent discards a creature card, put a 2-2 black zombie creature token onto the battlefield. And whenever an opponent discards a land card, add 2 swamps to your mana pool. And whenever an opponent discards a non-creature non-land card, draw a card. So you get a whole lot of different things going on there. Lots of triggers to pay attention to. And we have a mythic! Hazaret the Fervent, legendary creature god, 5-4 for 4 mana. If you're familiar with the most recent standard, this was one of the more powerful creatures in the mono red aggro deck. Has indestructible and haste and has a the fervent can't attack or block unless you have one or fewer cards in hand. Pay two in a mountain, discard a card, and has a deals two damage to each opponent. Fantastic. Holy okay. I swear I did not load the box out this well. There weren't that many crazy pulls left, but you got another mythic! This is Vivian Reed, legendary planeswalker. Vivian, five loyalty for five mana. Her plus one is look at the top four cards of your library. You may reveal a creature or land card from among them, put it into your hand, and put the rest on the bottom of your library in a random order. Her minus three is destroy target artifact enchantment or creature with flying and minus eight. You get an emblem with creatures you control, get plus two, plus two, 
and have Vigilance, Trample and Indestructible. Alright, so that is a fantastic... Holy crap, you get three Mythics. Palladium Ores, the Ruiner, Legendary Creature, Elder Dragon, 6-6, six, six, 4, 6 mana with Flying, Vigilance and Trample. And Palladium Ores, the Ruiner has Hexproof if it hasn't dealt damage yet. You are off to a great start here, sir. Alright, so I'll put these aside, and yes, you get your signed Jackalope Herd card for your first month as a patron. I'm sure everybody loves that, but we also supplement that with some Juicy Pools. Let's go with Battle Bond, and see if I can figure out how to open these packs, because this has sometimes proven to be a challenging operation for me, as you may have noticed on recent videos. And you should actually check out the craziest pool in MTG Unpacked History video. That was a couple of videos back. Got a ridiculous pool from Battle Bond. I did not expect that, but let's see how we do today. We have a zombie giant, an island, and a foil. Is that a foil rare? Holy moly. Diabolic Intent. This is a sorcery for two. As an additional cost to cast a spell, sacrifice a creature, search a library for a card, and put that card into your hand, then shuffle your library. Very nice. And your rare here is Spire Garden, so this is a land. Enters battlefield tapped unless you have two or more opponents, so you can tap it for mountains or forests. And moving right along, we have Impetuous Protege, Proud Mentor, so those two pair together, I believe. Aim high. And the commons we have Doomed Dissenter Claustrophobia, Doomed Traveller, there's a lot of doom today, Wandering Wolf, but not for Jonathan because he has done the standingly well, Azra Blade Seeker, Negate, Giant Growth, Yushin Soldier, Sparring Mummy, and that is it for Battle Bond. Alright, so he'll be getting the rares, mythics, and foils out of these packs and anything I find over a dollar in value in the other slots as well. So let's continue on with Guilds of Ravnica and I'm really butchering this pack here. Okay, what do we got? We got a Healer's Hawk, Dazzling Lights, Fire Urchin, Intrusive Pack Beast, Burglar Rat! Yes, we love the rats here. But we're running low on time and battery power on the camera here, so I can't dwell on that too much. Wary Akapi, Gravitic Punch, Watch It in the Mist, Pause for Reflection, Rosemane Centaur, and for the Uncommons we have Necrotic Wound, Justice Strike, Enhanced Surveillance, and the rare is Guild Mages Forum, so tap it for Colorless Mana, pay one and tap. Add one mana of any colour, and if that mana is spent on a multicoloured creature spell, that creature enters battlefield with an additional plus one plus one counter on it. Alright. And a Sesna Gilgate and an Angel token. Alrighty, so let's continue on with Dominaria. See if we can add to that mythic tally that you I think you pretty much cleaned out the mythics from here, although. Maybe there's a few more left, I'll have to check after this video. Next up we have Radiating Lightning, Vodalian Arcanist, Invoke the Divine, Drudge Sentinel, Whoa, Craziness, Mammoth Spider, Rescue, Rampaging Cyclops, Ace Seer Glider, Mesa Unicorn, look at that mane of hair, isn't that fantastic? Divination, and uncommons we have Fire Fist Adept Juggernaut. And your rare is Yorgmoth's Vile Offering, Legendary Sorcery for five. So you can cast Legendary Sorcery only if you control a Legendary Creature or Planeswalker. Put up to one target creature or Planeswalker card from a graveyard onto the battlefield under your control. Destroy up to one target creature or Planeswalker and exile Yorgmoth's Vile Offering. And that must mean... No, no foil. Oh, okay. Wasn't sure how the ordering worked here. So, Whisper Blood Liturgist, another uncommon, and a swamp, and a night token. Alright. Finally, Core 2019. 
Let's see if we can get something else out of this, something nice and pleasing. We start off with Sure Strike, Revitalize, Uncomfortable Chill, Catalyst Elemental, and I will say it's getting uncomfortably chilly around here. It was about 18 degrees today, and we had some weird snowfall that came out of nowhere, so that was very fun. Bog Stomper, Greenwood Sentinel, Two-Headed Zombie, just what you need. Elvish Rejuvenator, Vampire Neonate, Avon Wind Mage, and oh, there's a nice one. I'll pull that aside for you. Reliquary Tower is first the uncommons. Gargoyle Sentinel, Murder, and the rare is a Hungering Hydra. This is a creature Hydra 00 for X and a forest and enters battlefield with X plus one plus one counters on it. It can't be blocked by more than one creature, and whenever it's dealt damage, put that many plus one plus one counters on it. It must survive the damage to get the counters, alright? Pay attention to that. And a mountain, and a beast token. Alright, so there we have it. Those are some fantastic pulls for Jonathan today. Let's make sure I've got everything here. And of course that foil rare, so we've got two out of Battle Bond. Alright, we are all set then, so I'll pop those in his packet here, be mailing those out soon, just as soon as I've got through the other patron videos. And I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button for more Magic the Gathering unboxings, and be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released. And if you too would like to get in on the pet cracking action like Jonathan, again, the link to the Patreon will be in the description for this video. Thanks for watching and have a great day.